biggest venues in Portugal. Number one. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Well, Julian Alvarez, which is a player who I think is very intelligent with his movement. Often he plays in the, the number 10 position, he just drops that a little bit deeper to suit defenders in a position. And once he's done that, then he's capable of, of creative force in getting other people in behind. So there's an unselfishness to his game. And when he gets in front of the goal, he can be deadly too. Quite no argument for me on that one. As you can see, we've already started here. Ball. And the shot! Goal! Argentina! And it's Argentina in front! Uh, given such an open invitation, he was always going to shoot. It's almost criminal to see a defence fail to identify someone who thrives when it comes to shooting stats. They knew, and yet they didn't heed, and they've paid the price and deserved it. Well, that has certainly made things interesting. Tries to get it forward quickly. Gnabry gets up to hit it. Oh, he get the direction he needed. I have to commend the wing play, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Montiel. Brandt. Absolutely focused then on the defensive side of his game. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team really, your striker should be the first line of that defence and, and he's delivering. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Fernandez. And here's Lucas Ocampos. Out to the right. There has been just the early goal here, and it's 1-0. Up to meet it! <laughs> Hoists it forward. Now it's Brandt. Cleared away. That is as far as they're going to go. The Celso. He could be in here. And he's there to clear it. Brandt. Brandt passes it forward. Nicely controlled. Decent ball. Gnabry. Uh, it's a fine challenge and it goes his way. Montiel gets rid without sophistication. And it's played forward. There will be one minute and Come a on. Oh, taken with style. And right on half time. That is telling. The first 45 minutes are. So, a very watchable game so far, action at both ends and the team's level. And they come for the break with nothing to separate them, the score 1-1. So, we're just settling back into this second half. Werner. Havertz! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Starting it. Shula. Keira. Looking to hit the front line. Werner. Loselso. And it's Simeone. 
Chow. The attendance Kimmich. for this match was 16,892. Werner desperately wants to get on the end of this. Romero. Petzela. Romero goes looking. Lo Celso. Acuna. Tries lifting it over. Played into the massive lead. Oh, she just needed a better contact. Well, being able to generate that amount of activity in the box means it's hard not to pick someone out. Coming on to replace him is... Number seven, Rodrigo De Paul. Forward it goes. Acuna. Lo Celso. Tries to stroke it through. Tosses into the area. Havertz. Argentina showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all the results. A wonderful effort all by himself. He's the one player you want on the ball running at defences, and that's precisely why. He's going to have to go it alone. Fernandez. Looking cross field, changing the point of attack. Acuna. Lo Celso. Argentina cannot afford for this to peter out. There, there just isn't time attack. left. It is going to need 30 more minutes to win a round.